surfing, canoeing, hiking, these are all trademark activities in the Mohican area off the State Route Scenic Byway Wally Road. Until now, now we got a zip line. This is truly a world-class facility. I started comparing our statistics to other courses throughout the world and, and I really think this is going to be a top 10 course in, in the world, certainly in the United States. Uh, total course length is right around a little over 4,000 feet. It's 4,000 foot of cable divided into seven zips. Tree Frog Canopy Tours is a seven course zip line through the Mohican Forest with the shortest being 145 feet. <laughs> The longest line at 1,100 feet. We also have two suspension bridges. Uh, an example would be the bridge behind me, which is our entry bridge onto the first platform. This would be the shortest one of around 50 feet, the longest being 150 feet. That would be mid-course. In addition to the two bridges, we also rappel out of the trees off one of these platforms at two times during the tour. I really like this rappelling. I thought I was going to be scared, but I really like the rappelling down there like that. So. We've been putting off doing a lot of things and done with the, do, letting the kids do it all, and it's time for us to do it now. Whether you've done this before or not, this course is not for the faint of heart. You have to be somewhat athletic to, to take a canopy tour. It, it's not really, it's not an amusement ride, and um, there are single zip lines out there at various places. That's a ride. This isn't. You actually are participating in the sport. You're involved with your own braking. Um, if you don't make it to the next platform for some reason, um, you are involved in your own self-rescues. So it requires a healthy person. Safety of the participants is the chief importance on the zip line here for tree frog canopy tours. Safety of the trees was also a major factor in building this course. We found a, a company out of Colorado that builds a very sustainable canopy tour design. Um, they are industry leaders in protecting the trees. They do it in such a way that the trees are not choked off, the trees are allowed to grow. Um, every platform they build is adjustable, so every two years we can let the platform out a little bit to allow the tree more growth. In addition to the adrenaline rush of a canopy tour, we want to educate you. And, and so we're here to teach you about the trees. Uh, we've tried to get in as many different types of trees as possible. So what does this mean for the tourism industry? I think it's great. We've been working for several years here in Knox County to develop tourism. So along with the other activities on Wally Road, um, this certainly seems like an activity that will draw people. They can really come here and enjoy camping and canoeing and now this. Well, this is an incredible opportunity to bring travelers and visitors to Knox County. Uh, this kind of an attraction adds flavor, it adds opportunity, it adds excitement to our community uh, in ways that I don't think can even be described yet. Whether for the sheer enjoyment of an adrenaline rush zipping through the trees, or just to examine the canopy in the beautiful Mohican forest, Tree Frog Canopy Tours is bound to bring in more and more visitors from out of town.